Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to import a range of data from an existing sheet to a new sheet. So first you need your old existing sheet and for the sake of this video we have this data table here which shows different customers, their purchases, and where they're from. But say for example we have this new sheet and we want to plug that table from here into the new sheet. We don't just want to copy and paste because maybe there's a change we want to make and we want the change to go into the new sheet if we make a change from the old sheet. So there's a pretty simple way you would do it. So we're going to go to the new sheet, click on the first cell and we'll type in equals and we'll type in import range. Then we'll open our parentheses and now what you're going to do is you're going to go to the old sheet copy the URL and you're going to first put quotes in then paste the URL and put quotes around it then what you're going to do is add a comma and then also in quotes you're going to select the range that you want to choose from that old sheet and this range goes from A1 to F12 so in quotes you'll do A1 colon F12 end quotes and then we hit enter and you see there's a reference error because we have not allowed access to the other sheet yet so we're going to click allow access and it'll take a second and then we'll have the new sheet also you don't need to copy the whole URL there's only a certain portion of it that you absolutely need so the portion you need is I believe after the D where it goes google.com slash spreadsheets slash D it's this area that you can cut out everything before that and then you can also cut out everything after everything from edit on in the URL I believe that's it and then you hit enter and it works just the same so it's just that that chunk and I don't think you need the slash either yep so it's just the chunk from 1 to Q and you'll see on this one that it's everything after the slash after D and before the slash before edit that you need and that's pretty much it that's all you need to do to import a range over from an existing sheet to a new sheet and now that we've allowed access once, the next time we do import range on this sheet from the old sheet, it's not going to ask for permission. So that's pretty much it. If you learned something here, a like and a comment would be much appreciated. And as always, please subscribe. Thank you.